Caleb Williams and the Bears look completely lost. They have for the past few weeks, and now today it becomes a 19-3 loss against the New England Patriots back at Soldiers Field. So this has just been a disastrous couple of weeks and a stretch for the Bears. So Caleb Williams, he was the first QB drafted, but it's very clear that he's playing the fourth best when you factor in Jaden Daniels, Drake May, and Bo Nix. And a lot of that could very well be coaching because Shane Waldron, that offensive coordinator, and Matt Eberflus at head coach have really just not inspired anything to believe that they could make the best out of Caleb Williams, and it looks like the Bears will be going in a different direction shortly, if not, the, if not right away, then at the end of the season. So the Patriots had nine sacks today alone against Caleb Williams, and Caleb Williams was coming into the Bears with playoff expectations because of this situation. But what I think was overlooked in this situation was, number one, the offensive line is not ready to protect him. He is just not ready to play behind an offensive line this bad, I mean, to put it into simple terms, and then also the coaching staff, whether it's Matt Eberflus or Shane, Shane Waldron, it just seems like the Bears will be cleaning the house in their coaching staff soon to get someone that could actually help develop Caleb Williams. My question is, does do they even make it through the season? Because what is stopping the Bears right now from not firing a guy like Matt Eberflus or Shane Waldron midseason? Because it simply isn't working now, and I don't think we've seen many encouraging signs.